Hey guys, uh, my name is Cesar Garcia. I'm from uh, Jacksonville, Florida, and um, I wanted to show you my uh, sneaker collection on uh, Jay's Two Kicks uh, Instagram for Urban Necessities. Um, where I'm from, there's not really a big sneaker culture. The culture's not really here, unless you go more down south Florida. But other than that, you're in the south. And I mean, besides Atlanta, Georgia. But other than that, there's not a big culture influence out here. Like, I'm originally from the west coast, and I mean, up north in New York and all of that. But anyways, I've been collecting sneakers to build my fashion and uh, wanted to show you how it is in Florida. Um, so I started collecting sneakers a while back. Um, I started with like a weird Tumblr vibe with the uh, Toms. These are uh, weird off-brand Sperry's, Converse, of course, and Vans. And I've amassed a sneaker wall, but you know, I had to pick up the pink Roshis. Personally, they're like Miami vibes for me. I really like those, and uh, we'll go to Miami. Obviously, I'll wear them. And I like the man fashion boots wise. I got the Sperry Chucka boots. Very good shoes. I mean, I've had them for a good bit now, and they're sturdy. Chelsea boots and the Timberlands. Obviously, it's kind of odd to see a boot type fashion in Florida, but I kind of like, like it because it's different out here. Obviously, you got the skate highs, the beat up Converse, the builds character. These are actually my first pair of Jordans. Um, yeah, I bought them for a hundred bucks. Um, I'm not really from a family sneakerheads or anything of that. And uh, I was a broke boy when I got these. These were uh, kind of the first cop for me. But I started working and I'm a college student now. And these are actually a brand called Raid, Raidy. Um, these are actually a gift for my sister for my fashion. But let's get to the more hype sneakers on my sneaker wall. You got the skate high white vans. You got the Air Force Ones. Obviously, you need that in this year. This was actually one of my first hype beats pickups. Peak the crap, but this is a bare brick for L1. Think other, um, you know, I am other. You know, all that good stuff where it moves. You know, I got the limited edition Gardas uh, Yu Gi Oh card. You know, I got that in sixth grade. 40 bucks. Got the Fly Nets. And the Vapor Maxes, actually these, I did them up with the orange laces, don't really match too much, but you know, you got the off-white Vapor Maxes coming out that are all orange, and so I'm not too much of a person who cops resale value, but it's going to be insanely hard or even impossible for me to even pick up those Vapor Maxes, so I just thought these were the closest thing I could get to them, and um, without paying resale, I was paying, you know, what, 180 200 for these? I mean, they're comfortable shoes, I love them. He's actually one of my first sneaker pickups that really got me into it was these uh, red and white Hirachis. Still wear them, still look clean, got to keep them clean. And it's my uh, second pair of Jordans, the 13s. I love the 13s. I'm definitely a 13 and 11 guy. Um, I like my 12s, I like my 1s, I like my 4s. The rest I love, but they're just not really too much of me. And uh, moving on to... This rack right here, I got the Tupelo Shadow High Tops. That was actually a gift from my sister, too. Got the Vans. I mean, these are hyped. Um, I like them. I come from Cali, so Vans are a big thing. So you got to keep your Vans. I love the vibe of these. And I got the, obviously, checkerboard Vans. They're the gold authentic ones, not the white ones. So it looks a little yellow in the sun, but they still work. And these are actually my favorite Jordans, Legend Blues. Got a scratch on them, but my favorite. I wear them all the time, obviously. You can see, kind of very much worn, but I love them. And I got the Pumas. These are actually a bigger size, but they're on sale, so got them. And uh, I used to work at Finish Line, too. So I just went to my store with uh, my old peeps, and yeah, I got them. Obviously the new balances were hyped. My favorite color is red and I like these. I don't really care for that too much on the back But you got to have the new balances in your collection and the Pumas got the Puma suede's like Vans But you know, I just like you know, you like to mix it up throw some Puma throw some new balance Then I got the NMDs very common. They stop forever. thought these would go fast, but they didn't got the ultra boost might be a little dirty, but you know, I'll clean them more later, but very comfortable. Red MD, one of my favorite sneakers. 
Actually, got the white LMD, but colored them all up. Um, I just thought, actually, I got really tired of cleaning them, so this was the best scenario. These got really dirty really fast. Ultra Boost, I've been fortunate. White Vans, I've been fortunate. But these, very unfortunate. Then I got the black superstars and the white superstars. And so I've been working a lot lately. And obviously, I shouldn't be working too much because I'm a college student. I go to UNF. But finally, caught my first pair of Yeezys. I actually put 200 on these. And I traded a pair of the, the red Jordan 11s, the 96s. And um, I got these at Genetic Souls in uh, Jacksonville. And uh, Genetic Souls is a new store. So it has all the hype resale uh, sneakers, which is actually good because there's not a lot of stores like that around here. I've just got my slides. There's not a lot of stores like that around here. So uh, essentially, that's good for the culture out here. And I got this at ABP. That's another store, but it sells a lot of these for retail. So it's a good store. It's definitely bringing the culture here. So yeah.